Now let's uh, look at some other interesting facts about cats. So, did you know that cats uh, who are permitted to wander outdoors are exposed to a variety of hazards? including contagious diseases such as feline acquired immune deficiency syndrome or um, feline aids fiv and cats that kill and eat rodents and other small animals can become infected with uh, toxoplasma gondii which can be transmitted to humans and cause the disease toxoplasmosis and if you didn't know about this, you, you really need to look this up because it is incredibly fascinating. I won't tell you much right now because it's a uh, viewer discretion. You can look it up uh, on your own time. Okay, another one. Number two, cats spend between 30 to 50% of the day grooming themselves. This serves several purposes. It helps them tone down their scent so they can avoid predators. Um, it cools them down, it promotes blood flow, and it distributes uh, natural oils evenly around their coat. Grooming also serves as a sign of affection between two cats, and also it's thought their saliva contains enzymes that uh, serve as a natural antibiotic for wounds. Number 3. Cats often purr when they are content, but they also purr when they are sick, stressed, hurt or giving birth. It is not really known why they purr. Not when, we established when. Uh, but why this sound? You know, one hypothesis is that the sound frequency of purring uh, between uh, 25 and 150 hertz can improve bone density and promote healing. According to Leslie Lyons at the uh, University of California, uh, because cats have adapted to conserve energy via long periods of rest and sleep, it is possible that purring is a long energy mechanism that stimulates muscles and bones without a lot of energy. Interesting, isn't it? Um, number four, unlike humans, cats cannot detect sweetness, uh, which likely explains why they are not drawn to it at all. Number five, the Cat Fanciers Association, CFA, yeah, there is such a thing. Uh, recognizes 44 breeds of cats. Surprisingly, the longest living cat on record, according to the uh, Guinness Book uh, of World Records, belongs to the late Creme Puff of Austin, Texas, who lived to the ripe old age of 38 years and 3 days. Number 6. A cat's cerebral cortex contains about twice as many neurons as that of dogs. Cats have 300 million neurons, whereas dogs have about only 160 million. Like I said before, gotta take a take at the dogs. Cats rule. Number 7. Sir Isaac Newton is credited with creating the concept for the pet door that many cats use today to travel outdoors. <laughs> Number 8. A rich British antique dealer named Ben Bria loved his cat Blackie so much that when he died in 1988, he left most of his estate, totaling nearly $13 million, to the lucky, albeit likely indifferent, feline. The money was split among three cat charities which had been instructed to keep an eye on Rhea's beloved companion. To this day, Blackie holds the Guinness World Record for wealthiest cat. Number 9. A group of kittens born to the same cat are called a Kindle. See? So much more than an e-reader. And a group of full-grown cats is called a Clouder. Number 10. And probably the last one, otherwise we will be here forever. Usually, we think it's the other way around, but even if you're not allergic to cats, your cat might be allergic to you. 1 in 200 cats are believed to have asthma, and this number continues to rise among indoor cats as they are more frequently exposed to cigarette smoke, dust, human dandruff and pollen. All right, all right, let's go for a few more, right? Number 11. Cats only sweat through their paws and nowhere else on their body. 
Number 12. Cats have three eyelids and around 70% of cats life is spent sleeping. I know some humans who can achieve the 70% mark as well. Not me of course. Number 13. Unlike humans, cats are usually lefties. Studies indicate that their left paw is typically their dominant paw. I knew most of the facts before I started compiling them um, these uh, for this episode. But this was a completely new one. I will need to look more into it. Um, and if someone can confirm it, please let me know. Number 14. Male cats have barbed penises. Disclaimer. I did not check that myself. While painful for the lady cat, they do serve a purpose. The barbs stimulate the vulva, allowing the female to ovulate and they also keep her from escaping mid-coitus. Cats are usually solitary and they're not really that big of a fan of any um, sexual encounter. Number 15 and this really is the last one this time. Most cats don't like getting wet because they lose control. At least uh, that's what some experts believe that cats hate water because it's uncomfortable for uh, to have soggy fur or because it's frightening for a cat to lose control of its buoyancy. Uh, but not all hate water. Breeds uh, including the Turkish Van, uh, Maine Coons and Bengals are said to enjoy taking a dip every now and then. Obviously, that's not universal across um, those breeds as well. I had a Turkish man a long time ago called Mr. Whiskers and he hated the water. Anyways, that's it for the interesting facts.